Unfortunately, cheating to see through blocks in Minecraft is as easy as switching texture packs. Cheating players find the good stuff much earlier than honest players and almost always take everything they can find, leaving nothing for honest players to collect. As a server owner, you have two major options to solve this problem, Anti-X-Ray and Orbfuscator. Anti-X-Ray works by preventing players from mining diamonds too soon after joining the server and from mining diamonds too frequently later, so diamonds remain in the ground for other players to find. Because the limitations are generous, most honest players will never encounter the diamond limitation and remain blissfully ignorant. The few honest players who do get a link to a brief video explanation of how the system works, so they don't bother other players or server administrators with questions, and everyone can happily play Minecraft and find diamonds without dealing with cheaters. It's an efficient, effective solution to ensure cheating players don't ruin the game for honest players. There are a few situations where anti-X-Ray isn't enough because it only protects ore. If you're running a server which heavily emphasizes PvP or allows griefing, then there's another more expensive option called Orbfuscator that might be right for you. It actually prevents players from looking through blocks, which means players will be able to effectively hide themselves and their builds from cheaters. However, I don't recommend it for most servers because, unfortunately, Orbfuscator works very hard, consuming a lot of memory and processor time, which contribute to lag and hosting expense. It can also nearly double the hard drive space your server requires, and most small servers can't afford to run it without a database, which can become a maintenance headache later. So to summarize, unless you're running a server that's really big on PvP or griefing, I recommend Anti-X-Ray because it ensures diamonds for everyone efficiently at almost no cost. Otherwise, give Orbfuscator a try and decide for yourself whether or not the performance trade-off makes sense for you. I hope this comparison helps you make the best decision for your server, and I also hope that one day, Mo Yang will finally just fix this problem for everyone. Thanks for watching and good luck with your server.